And this time it's a beer from the Wild Beer Company, uh, Wild Goose Chase, Farm, Farmhouse Pale, Gooseberry and Zingy. <coughs> Drink widely different. Here's the um, brewer logo on the black cap. And <coughs> around it's a Wild Beer Company twice. It's 4.5% ABV. Brewed and bottled in the wild beer uh, by the Wild Beer Company in the United Kingdom. Lower Westcombe Farm, Ever Creech, Shepton, Mallet, Somerset. Right. <coughs> oh, long story. Look, long story here to. To, uh, to read contains wheat, gooseberries, and barley malt. Gooseberries, right? <coughs> we believe exceptional brewing uh, stems from imagination and passion. It's not just a process. Never average every wild beer is a result of a wild mind. Co Conceiving, creating, and cre crafting beers that explore the boundaries of your palate. Brewing doesn't need to be confined by rules, tradition, or ingredients. By adding a wild fifth ingredient or process to our beers, we want to give you a truly memorable drinking experience, altering your perception and thrilling your taste buds drink widely different. We thought we would never make this beer exactly as we wanted. In fact, it felt like a bit of a wild goose chase. The all-day wild beer, tart and fruity, yet well hopped and drinkable. We have been chasing this beer since we started the brewery and, and love this combination. Juicy, tart go gooseberries and our own culture of wild yeast from local orchards give this a gentle acidity <coughs> with complementary hops and a generous dry hop enhance the fruitiness and give a light but moreish bitterness. Mm -hmm. It is a little bit sediment on the bottom, so it looks like he's uh, bottle conditioned. You know what, actually I like this design. Uh, minimalistic, but fine. A little bit too much to, to read on the back, but not everyone uh, read it, so it's not a problem. Right, let's open it. Ah, uh, you can smell the sourness. and funkiness in it a little bit but mostly sourness <coughs> let's pull it out first it will be a little rather clear Ooh. right <laughs> it looks a little bit, uh, almost clear there is some haziness very pale straw even even not straw it's, 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 it's even you know perrier than this small head white um, medium bubbles rather ah what is this definitely funky Sour, a um, little bit of gooseberries. 
Uh, quite nice fresh aroma. Right, let's have a try. Nice carbonation, sour. With bitterness. Bitterness is um, grassy. Hmm. It is a little bit of um, <coughs> gooseberries in in the taste as well. It tastes a little bit like a um, champagne. It has the same um, sourness and dryness, right? But you have some um, fruity sourness in it. Yeah, definitely uh, like. Um, Little bit like um, you know cider, in a bit, or apple wine. Yes. Very refreshing. Very drinkable. Very nice. Right. Now. <clears throat> I'll try to get some mm, sediment from the bottom. I think it will be enough. Like you see, it's very hazy now. <sighs> yeah, it's much more um, stable. Much more farm in it, but it's it. It's not so much. It's not so much. Uh, it's very gentle. It's a little bit more easty. A little bit more spicy. And I would say, less sour with the east from the bottom but very nice very refreshing mm, sour beer quite nice I like it So, it looks like it, it is a farmhouse ace, ale or saison with a <coughs> funky twist, right? So we have a sourness in a light summer ale. I said summer ale, but it's not a, like a um, style because uh, saison was brewed for a summer to drink for farmhouse workers, right? When you had, a, I don't know, been taking uh, all the goods from the farm, from the your land in the summer, the workers were drinking something like this. Yeah. But this one is, you know, a little bit wild. With a little bit funky, a little bit sour. Nice, refreshing. I like it. So I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed this beer. Please like it. Please subscribe my channel and cheers.
Thank you.